I was at a garage sale. It was a digger garage sale, which you just dig around through piles of junk. <laughs> and the gentleman asked me basically what I'm looking for. And I said, pretty much anything old. And he dug, I think, the cylinder up and brought it out. And he said, would you be interested? And I said, uh, yeah, I love it. And he says, I think I have another one. And he dug around and he found the cone. He asked $40 and I didn't argue one little bit. I gave him the money and on the way out, he says, wait a minute, wait a minute. He says, I know I have another one. And he brought out the sphere. He didn't ask for any more money. He says, That's, you already paid me and down the road I went. I, I cannot find anything on them. I don't know whether they're toys or teaching aids. I mean, I found both, both information online, so I have no idea. Well, um, you got it right on the teaching aids part. <laughs> okay. um, so what these are, these are wooden models to help students learn in geometry about volume. Okay. So these were invented in the latter part of the 19th century by a gentleman named Albert Kennedy. He was in Rockport, Indiana. The patent that Albert Kennedy filed in 1881 um, was granted in 1883 for one of the objects and then it went from there. Okay. These teaching tools um, were being distributed as late as 1917. And by that point, they were being more mass produced by a firm in Chicago. What you've brought us today, they're in this beautiful maple. They've got this great sculptural quality and they have a decorative appeal on their own. But let's look at what they do as a teaching okay. tool. So I'm gonna start with the cylinder closest to you and it comes in half, opens up. Right, okay. So here's your cylinder that you brought us got this great conical model that comes down. <laughs> it's very, very cool how they thought this up. It's, it's amazing. The sphere was probably my favorite. Uh, yeah. Definitely the largest. Yeah. We can show, here's just opening up one slice of it. Mm -hmm. And then I think it's maybe at its best when you get it, it all the way open. Yes. And it, takes just a little bit of doing and it kind of falls out, but we get to this really wonderful star formation. And again, it's, it's a, another piece of sculpture now. It's beautiful. So not only is it educational, but it's decorative. Yeah. We'll put it back together here. So one more thing I think we need to talk about are these two metal objects here on the table with us. Okay. Uh, these are the covers that came with these, I think we're probably missing a second piece. Okay. Uh, you know, this would have helped keep this in its shape. So your $40 purchase is probably worth, and this is a retail price, okay. somewhere in the range of $1,500 to $2,000. Holy smokes. Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow. They're not going anywhere. <laughs>